Uh, Scott, first off, thank you for that amazing closing keynote. As always, you always give practical advice. You share real personal stories. And I really commend you on what Spiffy's done. I've watched that ABC News segment, and it was really touching and heartwarming to see the way you quickly turned and are now helping others. So I applaud you for that. And thank you for supporting Startup Summit and sharing that advice. We want to thank all of you for joining this conference. Our whole goal was that it would help you become bigger, better and stronger and help you survive and thrive through this pandemic. We're going to make all these videos available to you on startupsummit.io in addition to Startup Summit on Facebook and LinkedIn. And if you have any questions, feel free to contact me uh, or Mark Vavisato. You can find us on LinkedIn or through startupsummit.io website. We want to thank Steve as well. Steve's been very instrumental Absolutely. in helping helping this conference happen. We want to thank Ian. Ian is the man, the Wizard of Oz behind this whole scene. Ian's been phenomenal. And uh, I want to close with two quotes, and we'll give it back for you to say whatever you like, Mark or Steve. But President Roosevelt, during the Great Depression, had to come to America in the, in the mis middle of chaos, in the middle of fear, and remember his famous quote that he says, have no fear. The only thing we have to fear is fear itself. And if you take this quote to today and you listen to what Mary Curry said, the famous physicist, she says, nothing in life is to be feared. It's only to be understood. And now is the time to understand more so that we may fear less. So learn more, understand more, have no fear, and let's go forward and turn this crisis into an opportunity. So with that, I want to thank you all for joining. Hand it off to Steve or Mark if you want to say anything else. And thank you, Ian, for, for helping making this conference possible. Yep. I'll just hop in real quick before Steve wants to say anything, but just want to thank uh, HPG and Trinet again for their, their amazing donation to the Healthcare Hero Response Fund. And then all, all the, the you guys that donated too, um, it's going to go a long way and we really appreciate it. And we hope you have some practical advice that you can now go and apply to your business. And Steve, you got any final thoughts? No, I just want to thank everyone for attending. Um, I'm always here to help. If you any ideas you have about what cities can do to be more innovative, I learned a lot about how we can fight this war together. And I think um, there's no better place to do it here in the Triangle. And there's mo no better time than now to um, to be a wartime CEO. And so uh, I'm walking away inspired. I will hopefully next year we can do this in person so we can go all to the bar and have a beer and still social distance. But for now. I just want to thank Ian, my team, for helping with this, uh, Mark, and everybody, and Keith, and everybody. Thank you. And let's take our moonshot. We're going to make it happen. And failure is not an option. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Ian. We appreciate all your help. And everybody, we'll, we'll talk to you soon. Thank, thank you. Thank you all. Have a great Friday, great weekend. Cheers. Bye-bye. Right. Bye-bye.